Alright, hello people. Something's just fallen off my helmet. And I don't know what it was. I don't know what it was. Well, I've no idea what that was. Although, um, yesterday um, I put my helmet, uh, I put my helmet down, and the visor scoop took some pebbles. So when I put it onto uh, my helmet stand uh, yesterday, pebbles fell out. So I'm thinking that um, a pebble got stuck just up there. When I closed my visor, it just popped out, bounced off my shoulder, hit my leg and fell up the floor. But that's what I'm thinking happened just then. Because I can't find anything else that, um, that could have fallen off my helmet. I've checked all the screws and mounts and everything else. But hey ho, you know what I say, such is, I say, I say, I say such is life. Might have been better off going the other way, because uh, there's a lot of cars. That's because as well at Circus, it's car boot day as well. Yeah, anyway, today, um, Phil's going to pick up his, his new bike. Well, new to him. It's an SV. And we're going on to Hornsey! Meeting him down at Oasis at 11. Yeah, I think there's me, Phil, Tina, Michael... And, and I can never remember his name. Uh, just get a little bit of fuel. Uh, seen a bit, folks. All fueled up. Go down to Oasis now. And I'm going to be like 40 minutes early. But I can sit, I can chill out, have a cup of tea or a hot chocolate or something wait for them because it's a nice day and today is not going to be a, a mad riding day or all like that because Phil and Tina are going on Tina's SV obviously they've got a right bike back and there's one or two things that he needs to do to it so coming back he can't be he can't be powering it on or anything it's an absolutely glorious day hardly any clouds in the sky just how we like it I found remote for my for my drifts because it had gone adrift. Um, yeah, fat remote. Uh, I must have turned the Wi-Fi off off this one because it's just not connecting at all. Uh, what are you betting? Because it's a lovely sunny day. It's a Sunday. Those cash cows are going to be out in force. And you all know exactly what I mean by cash cows. Uh, Tony was supposed to be coming with us today, but well, we asked him, but he's still got a, a bad throat and he says he's got a lot to do, so... Don't know if Chris is coming, because I seem to remember him saying that he wanted to spend all day today working on bike, getting it ready for storming the castle, which is... Um, two weeks. I'm not going to it this year, uh, I guess I want to put all my money into getting this baby done, because I do tend to spend quite a lot. Um, uh, rallies, buying knickknacks and goodies and beer, beer, and beer, beer. And it looks like it's time for a bit of filterage. Oops, stalled it, dear. Never mind. Wondering how busy it's going to be down at seafront at this time of day. Uh, bus isn't stopping, it must be packed. God's sake, why is it going this way? That was my bad. But it shouldn't have been so going so bloody fast. I finally worked out what that wobbling is. When I stop, the bike rocks ever so gently like that. Feels like there's a pendulum in it. And I've just realised, duh, it's when I've just filled tank up. And usually when I stop, um, I've just turned. I've just gone into a gap. And it's the petrol swishing from side to side. Oh, bloody hell, what a glorious day. Unfortunately, our cell's doing 15 mile an hour. Oh, 10 mile an hour. Thank God they're turning off. Bloody tourists! 
ruining the riding experience of hundreds just so they can come to this beautiful sunny seaside town and spend the money yeah i know i'll go on moaning about tourists but you can't blame them can you i mean come on look at it cliffs castle sea sky sand it's got it all scarborough Right, I'm here at Oasis. Get a drink, wait for them lot, and I'll catch you all later. Bye for now. Ah, that's Phil and Tina in front. We've got all the guys behind us. Go pick Phil's bike up now. Hornsy. There's always, always an ambulance there. That's Scarborough Skate Park. Every day, someone gets hurt there. I'll tell you summit it's a bit warm. Got a little bit busier now. Lots and lots of bikes out. Bye, heck. Not to still do it, but that mixed grill there to do an absolutely gorgeous uh, mixed grill. Not that mixed grill there, it's called the Golden Grid. But they do an absolutely gorgeous mixed grill. It's about 18 quid, but by heck is it nice. And you get loads. So I'll call it a day. I'll say bye for now. Right safe, be strong and I'll catch you all later.